What is going on guys, Miles here, and today I'm going to be showing with you guys how you can get yourself two new DLC weapons which have just been added to Infinite Warfare. This is the RVN Assault Rifle and the UDM Pistol which you can get completely for free, let's do this. There was a pretty big update for Infinite Warfare today which added the first set of DLC guns and weapons into the game since the release which is pretty interesting. Uh, it is quite late into the season to be getting DLC weapons and I wasn't even sure if we were going to be getting them anytime soon but we have the RVN Assault Rifle, the UMD Pistol as well as the Axe Melee Weapon and you can get the guns for free. Uh, and the axe is only available in supply drops unfortunately but you can get yourself the RVN and the UDM pistol for free. So if you want to get yourself the RVN Assault Rifle, if you guys have the Season Pass, you will literally already have the gun, which you can use straight away. But if you don't have the Season Pass, you can still get it for free without spending a penny on the Season Pass or COD points. And in order to get it, you need to get 200 kills with an Energy Rifle with an accessory equipped that you've earned through a Weapon Prestige. If you're looking for tips, I would recommend using the Type 2 Assault Rifle because it is pretty damn good and it will help you get the weapon very quick, even though you do need to prestige the weapon first, so make sure you guys have that one in mind. It may take quite a while if you don't already have a prestiged energy rifle in the game, but it won't take too long, I'd say probably like a couple of hours in order to get yourself the RVN. As for the UDM, you don't get this pistol for free straight away if you have the Season Pass and you must also complete a challenge in order to unlock this weapon and the challenge is to kill 200 enemies with pistols with an optic equipped and an accessory which you've earned through Weapon Prestige. As far as I'm aware, the UDM challenge is the same for everyone, but I'm not 100% sure, so let me know down in the comments below what your challenge was. You can check by going on to create a class, going to handguns and then hovering over the DLC weapon. As for the third DLC weapon, which is the axe, you can't get this weapon for free unfortunately, and it is only available through supply drops, I don't think you can even craft the variants with salvage either, uh, but we'll have to wait and see, maybe they'll do an update which will allow you to actually craft the variants through salvage, which would be really sweet as well, but I'm actually just really happy that we got free guns into the game, this is like a super rare occurrence in Call of Duty, and the only time I can actually think of this was when they released the M1 Irons in Advanced Warfare for free, uh, which is absolutely awesome awesome and I'm super happy to see this update in the game. The RVN, the UDM and the Axe all have four different variants which you can get for the weapon. There's one common, one rare, one legendary and one epic which you can get through supply drops. I'm not exactly sure if you can craft them as of right now because the update has just came out but I'm going to assume you can't but they will make it available in the future to craft through salvage and if you're wondering what the variants are I've actually made separate videos on these from data mines which I'll leave links to in the description if you want to check them out. I haven't unlocked the UDM yet but I do have the RVN since I have the season pass for the game and I've used a little bit of it and I think it's pretty good. It's not an amazing weapon, it doesn't compete with like the K-Bar but it's not awful either and it is usable if you want to have a bit of fun using this weapon and it's a two burst as well which is pretty interesting because we don't have one of those in Infinite Warfare currently so that's quite nice to see some like weapon diversity going on there and it also has a pretty cool alternating mode if you hold triangle or Y I believe on Xbox where you like rip the gun into a Kimbo and it actually turns into a melee weapon where you can like electric shock people with the gun. It's pretty insane and I think it's pretty damn awesome as well. One last thing I forgot to mention is that you can get the two new weapons in Zombies as well. They are available through the magic box so if you get lucky you can try out those weapons even if you haven't spent money on them or got them in multiplayer. But there we have it, that's how you can get yourself two free DLC weapons in Infinite Warfare. Let me know what you think of this update down in the comments below and if you guys found the video useful remember to leave a like and subscribe to the channel for more Call of Duty but I'll see you guys in my next video.